Hi everyone, this is Danny for Dude Tech and welcome back with another beautiful video. In this video, I have another tweaks to share it with you guys. So first of all, I just want to tell you guys and show you guys my new set on my iPhone. How are you guys going to be like it? You guys can see here the weather that I have on the top and the day that I have inside here, the set of all my icons. This is what I do and this is what I got the new set uh, from the iWidget and then also I download some tweaks to work on all all the icons so tell me in the comment section if you guys want me to make a video specific telling you guys how you can set that and what you should download to make that happen on your iDevice so let's start right now talking about today's tweaks let's get into it all right so the first one that i have for you guys which is going to be the no folder background and what is that tweak is going to be providing you with is going to be move the background for your uh, any kind of file that you have in your iDevice and I'm gonna be showing you guys right now how is that gonna be looks like so if I want to go right now one of the my folder as you guys can see I have a folder here top on the folder and that's how it's gonna be the folder looks like so pretty much the tweak is gonna be move the whole background and it's gonna be make it nice clear and amazing if you want to set it on your iDevice so this is what is pretty much the tweak is gonna be providing you with when you download the tweak, the tweak has nothing to configure. It will be work right away when you set it on your iDevice. There you go, guys. Make sure to give it a try. No folder background. The next cool tweak that I have for you guys, which is going to be really amazing and gorgeous in my opinion. So it's going to be the classic player. And what is that tweak is going to be providing you with? It's going to be bring the interface of the classic iPod. And I'm going to be showing you guys right now how is that going to be looks like. So if you go to back to your home screen, you will be find the icon right there. If you press on the icon to launch the, the tweak, this is how is the tweak is going to be looks like. It's going to be bring that player, which is going to be a face of the classic iPod into your iDevice. So here on the top, as you guys can see, you can find your music and settings and other stuff. So if you tap on the music here, you will be find your music folder, which is going to be here. And in here, the scroll wheel is going to be the same of the old classic uh, iPod uh, using. So it's going to be the, the uh, right left track here. And then this is the menu and then the pose and playing here, as you guys can see. So this is really amazing if you top here and then you go to your all your music and then just choose the music that you want from here and then simply just stop on it. It's going to be a uh, work right away. And for sure, it's going to be work for the both, which is going to be the audio music and even the video of music so pretty much the, the both is going to be beautiful under the settings let me just go back to the settings if you guys go back to the settings as you guys can see there is a dark mode here so you can turn that on or if you want to turn that off it's going to be providing you with a white looking of the classic uh, view of the ipod and then here you have in the bottom which is going to be the sound effect so you can turn that on or off in here in the bottom we have the about so this is how it's going to be uh, looks like after you have done it from everything. So it's going to be up to you if you want to use the white looking or the dark looking. Really beautiful and nice set if you want to put it on your iDevice. Highly recommend you guys to give it a try. Classic player. The next one that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the surround track. It will be replace your tiny little page once you scroll down from your control center to open your music. And I'm going to be showing you guys what I'm talking about right here. All right. So usually when you open your control center, you want to go right to your, your music. This is how it's going to be. It looks like before it's going to be tiny when you scroll down from your control center. But right now, this is what is that week is going to be providing you with. It's going to be replace the whole set of your music page and right now it's going to be bigger which is going to be allow you to watch your video your uh, listening for your music much better than before this is what is that tweak is going to be providing you with no option to configure under the settings it will be work right away when you set it on your iDevice highly recommend you guys to give it a try soon after let me talk with you guys right now about the color pad 9 and what is that week is going to be providing you with it's going to be make you to customize and even give some effect transparent uh, make some colors using the that week to change some dot toggles or other stuff and i'm going to be showing you guys right now what i'm talking about under the settings 
all right guys so under the settings here as you guys can see the first thing that you need to do to enable the tweak and then you have more than option which is going to be the first one the height outline so you can just turn that on off the way you like transparent view if you want to make that in your eye device so you can simply turn that on keep it off and then here the color that i'm going to be talking with you guys about it so just choose the color here once you choose the color, all what you need to do, just make sure to respring your device so your device will be take all the effects. So after you complete for your set, this is how it's gonna be looks like using your lock screen. And even you can just make that all that transparent as I show you guys, and this is how it's gonna be looks like. There you go guys, make sure to give it a try, color pad nine. And next what I have for you guys, YouTube landscape. So that tweak is gonna be force the youtube app once you launch your youtube app to work on the landscape and i'm gonna be jump right now to the youtube showing you guys how is that gonna be looks like okay so pretty much when you launch your youtube application is gonna be force the youtube to work on the landscape and that's gonna be pretty much how is the tweak is gonna be looks like under the setting that is nothing to configure it will be work right away when you set the tweak using your i device there you go guys youtube landscape i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos and i see you guys in next video peace